My god, something bad happened here. Let me guess. Hi! Hello, everybody. My name is Jared, and welcome to Jar Red Gaming. Welcome to a game called Psychosis. Now, if this is your first time to the channel, we like to play games that maybe you've never heard of before. Perhaps this is one of those games. If that sounds like something you're interested in, then I implore you to hit that subscribe button and while you're at it, ring that notification bell icon so you don't miss out on future videos because we upload five days a week, Monday through Friday, so you don't want to miss out on new videos. That being said, I don't know anything about this game as usual. You guys probably getting tired of hearing me say that, but it's just the name of the game. It's the nature of the beast, what we do here on Jar Red Gaming. Blind game throughs, at least as blind as possible. So without further ado, let's just dive into this because I'm kind of curious is what it's all about. It is the summer of 1986. I was born that year. You get a call from your office to find that you need to investigate another murder. You reluctantly board the train and ride it until its last stop. The abandoned something? Did it say factory? It was. It went away. Ooh, look at this though. Ooh. Ooh, our feet make noises. Do we have a body? We have no body. I like the ambience of this train, but I do not like the looks of where we are though. Why would the train lead here? <laughs> uh, it's already started and I just started the game and it already jump scared me. <laughs> I was not prepared for that. I need to change my armor. I'm sorry, Carl. I don't have any other armor for you. Okay, great. Okay, great. Where the hell are we? Why are we? No, this is not how murders are investigated. You don't just take a train to the middle of some abandoned factory industrial complex by yourself. Okay, where do I even go? Where are we? What country is this? This train, it makes no sense. It, it makes no sense. How did it get here? No! There's nothing guiding this train! There's no engine! There's no... anything! What in the world? Check the warehouse. Sure! Because this game already makes so much sense. Look at all that. I mean, it really looks cool, though. I'm not gonna lie. Like, the lighting is fantastic. Really digging it. Uh, is this... Is this where I need to go? Hello? I'm here at random. It seems the door is closed. Try the fuse box in the building opposite the warehouse. Okay, great. Can we remove the text from my face, please? Okay, building across from the warehouse. Here we go. Fuse box, is that you? Press E to interact. I'm sure nothing bad will happen once we do. Is that it? No sounds, no... No scares? I probably shouldn't press my luck by saying such things. Why would the fuse box open the door to this train in here? It doesn't- this place makes no sense. It's set up like an amusement park or like a... Yeah, like an amusement park or something. It's not set up like a train, anything. Hi! Oh good, a note. Perfect. I am always watching. Well, uh! note collected. Oh, good for me. You're always watching me, even when I'm pooing. So that's why I keep hearing those breathing sounds whenever I'm going to the bathroom. Freaking creeper. It's gonna pop out in front of me again. I know it. Carl, prepare yourself. Okay. Now what? Now what? Now what? No, but seriously, like, now what? Like, I got the note. I mean, we're not here for notes. We're here to solve a murder, aren't we? Hello? I'm looking for more notes, apparently. Seems to be my new objective. So says gaming logic. Oh, I don't want to go in here. I really don't. I really don't. Oh good, another note. It says get out. Fantastic. 
Fantastic. I would love to get out. I would love it. Oh. Keys? What do I need keys for? Why can't I just crawl over this or under this? Seriously. I can't even get up on this. Wow, we have no legs reach, apparently. <laughs> what are the keys for? But now that I've got keys, something bad's going to happen. Every time you pick up keys, something bad happens. Just mind my own business. As long as I mind my own business, the ghost won't come after me. I mean, there was a door in the in the fuse room. Maybe I, maybe the keys are to there. Is this a door that I can enter? Okay, it is. But I don't know if the key was for that or not. Okay, light quit. Another note. You're next. Great. Can we get it over with then? Can I pick up this note? Is there going to be something behind me? I keep thinking there's going to be something behind me in these games, and there isn't. These developers are changing up their tactics a little bit. Their jump scare tactics are, are changing. They're evolving. Oh, good. Let's just parkour our way into some more creepy... Oh, this is definitely going to hold my weight. <laughs> How even? Oh, God. Where? Another key. Are you serious? Where's this key go? Is it to this door down? It's got to be to this door, right? Can I just fall down? Damn it. I don't like this. I don't like this one little bit. Is this my lucky number door? I mean, there's a padlock there. And I can see through it, but I don't think that's where we're supposed to go. And maybe this is... Maybe this gate? Is it the gate? It's gotta be the gate, right? It's key to the gate? It's a key to the gate, I bet. I mean, I don't know. It's not making a key sound. Oh! <gasps> I think we found the murderer. Get your gun, dude. We're here to investigate where then we clearly have a gun, right? I'm leaving. Later. Somebody spin into the bath salts again. Lady. Please stop. Oh, God. Why? Why? Why are we doing this? Take one of these propane tanks and throw it at her. Hey. Of course you're not real. <laughs> Why would you be real? Or is it me? It always has been. Unity asset, policeman. My god, something bad happened here. Let me guess. Hi! <laughs> they were clearly very slow. I think we could have outrun them, even though they're kind of a ghost, I think. I don't know. Um, there you have it. That psychosis is very short. Um, apologize for the short video, but sometimes these games are just short, guys. You know, I try to find longer games, or I try to put two games or three games together, but sometimes... Sometimes it's just a short game, but it was really cool. It looked great. Like the lighting was fantastic. Like you don't see, you know, lighting that good in indie games that often. Um, that was very impressive. And the jump scare in the beginning got me real good. Got Carl pretty good too. He's got nothing to say though. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like, please leave a comment. And if you're new to the channel, again, once again, I implore you to subscribe to the channel because there's so much more where this came from. And as always, thank you so very much for watching. You've been awesome. Let's play again soon, and I'll see you in the next video.